Ranger Citadel. Come in, Scorpion HQ. This is Bergen again, calling from High Pool. We are still under attack. These damn records are blowing us to pieces. Send help, anyone. High Pool, this is Ranger Citadel. Our closest team is already answering a call at Ag Center, but they will try to reach you as soon as they can. You read me? Over. Yeah, yeah, Vargas. We've heard it all before. High Pool always comes last, doesn't it? Scorpions don't treat us like second-class citizens. The Scorpions don't go! Shit! Hit the deck! Room. Great. Okay, now listen. The computer is basically fried. Unless your secret team is hackers, its functions are going to be pretty limited for now. It'll only be able to open one airlock at a time. I don't get down here a lot. Afraid I don't know much about it. Good lord. Look at the size of that mushroom. Skinner knows these caves better than anyone.
And now, Ryan, Dr. Herbison, that is, looks like he didn't reach his weapon in time. Go away, Sergio. Go away, Sergio. Go away, Sergio. Go away, Sergio. You ain't Sergio no more. Please, don't make me shoot you. Don't make me do to you what I had to... to... <laughs> Rangers, you bastards, what took you so long? Hang on, I'll unbar the door. still people. So what are you doing here? You come to save the day? Well, you're too late. Oh, hi, Dr. Rose. Didn't see you there. My son, he was with his mama in the field when everything went insane. I guess he must have caught the sickness somehow, because when he came home with Marta, he, he attacked me just like she did. So glad the blast that killed Marta, scared him off. I couldn't bear to kill my wife and my son in the same day. Who? Oh, you mean Sammy Haas, the snake squeezins man? Yeah, he was there when Ace was attacked. Don't know how much you'll get out of him though. He was so scared when he told me, I could hardly understand what he was saying. Maybe if you would have come earlier, I wouldn't have had to kill my wife. What the hell took you so long? If you're lucky, he'll be in Real Nomad. That's where he stocks up on snake squeezes before he makes his rounds. They are God's greatest gift to his creation. Most delicious thing you'll ever taste. It really takes the edge off, well, everything. I couldn't get much sense out of him about that. All I know is that someone or something attacked him, and Ace fought it and died. You want more details? You'll have to get them from Sammy, if you can. Thanks, but I don't know if I'm ready to go. Don't want to see any ghosts. What else would you call dead people you knew and loved who are still up and walking around? I killed one already. I don't want to kill no more. My... my wife Marta, she and my son Sergio were out in the fields when the madness started. I guess they came down here to the caves to find me. They found me all right, but it wasn't them no more. 
I started seeing it in the mushroom caves about an hour ago. The mushrooms growing out of control, the other guys getting sick, acting funny. Then the alarm started going off. I tried to head upstairs to find Marta and Sergio, but Doug from engineering and a few of the others chased me in here and tried to tear my face off. And then, then Marta and Sergio showed up. If I found out somebody sabotaged us, I'd, I'd kill them. That's where we experiment with new breeds of mushrooms and other fungi. Not the cheeriest job in the world, being underground all day, but I like it. Cool and quiet down there. At least it was, until the madness started. Can't say for sure, but I have my suspicions. That Sioux fella, for one, always trying to breed weird new plants. Maybe one of his experiments got out of control. Some of the fellas thought somebody might put something in the nutrient mix. They headed off for the irrigation shutoff valve with Doc Larson to turn it off. I don't think they made it, though. I can still hear the pumps. That boy's a strange one, and I don't mean his name. Knew a guy named Moonbat once, so Sue don't phase me. Kathy hired him on as a research assistant, but all he does is bitch about the way we do things around here. Keep saying the plants should be free. That we shouldn't be hoarding them all to ourselves. If you ask me, he's the fella behind this mess. He did something to the plants to make them tear this place apart and escape into the world. If I see him, I'm gonna give him one for Marta and Sergio right between the eyes. Larson said that closing the pump valve would shut down the irrigation system. Maybe keep the infestation from getting any worse. Been gone way too long, though. Doc's a great guy. Been keeping us fit and healthy ever since he showed up here a year ago. Me and him are good pals. He always comes down to the mushroom cave to chat and pass the time. Always interested in what we're working on down here. Said fungi and molds could be very useful to him in his work. And now he's gone up with the fellas to help shut down the pumps while well, i just been hiding in this storeroom. Makes me ashamed of myself. He doesn't even own a gun. I just hope he's still alive. We're all gonna need a lot of healing when all this is over. They push water and fertilizer out to all the fields and greenhouses. Sort of the beating heart of Ag Center. I can't help it. My son's out there. What's left of him anyway. I don't want to come upon him suddenly and have to, to shoot him. Much better if somebody else does it. Hey, Rangers, if you're gonna be heading out, would you mind me coming with you? Talking to you has made me ashamed to be hiding when there's work to be done. I know I might meet my son out there, but that shouldn't stop me from trying to get moving and see what I can do to help upstairs. Can I follow you? Just till we get out from the caves? Thank you. I feel better already. Okay, let's go.
Never liked mushrooms. Making them bigger hasn't helped. Hey, thanks for leaving me out. Please look for Sergio. I just know he'll turn up. I just wish I was strong enough to go with you. yet. Matt is deteriorating rapidly. Thank God you're just in time. Give it to me and wait right here. Matt, your case is very acute. I'm going to have to inject a high concentration dose directly into your veins. Kathy, I... I don't... I don't think... Shut up and give me your arm. I... I can feel it working. Hurts, but it's better. Better. Th thank you, Kathy. Thank you, recruits. I I'm, I'm gonna need some more time on the sidelines, but I, I think... I think I'm gonna make it. Thank you, Rangers. If you have a sec, I have one more request for you. You'll be especially interested if any of you caught the infection. There's one last thing to be done. Get the cure into the fertilizer reservoir. Before you can do that, you'll need to finish shutting down the irrigation system. Come back here when you've done that. Larson has been a godsend here. Not only is he a fine general practitioner and surgeon, he's doing great work in the field of fungal biology. He has really expanded our areas of research. See you around, Rangers. Hey there, recruits. We've been watching you on the security cams. You're really going above and beyond for my people, and you sure as hell saved my ass. I can't thank you enough. Except a promise I'll put in a good word with Vargas. Oh, and if you head to my office, I got some supplies for you. Here's the key to the door. Check the safe. Use 80085 to open it up. Mine is the first door on the left through the West Hall. Things are a little vulture. Thanks for coming by, Rangers. Always good to see you oh, yeah, taking no Congratulations!
This must be Matt's office. 